Well, first, a Robertsdale man accused of holding his children hostage for days remains jailed tonight after a four day standoff eventually pulled him from the attic. Fox 10's Lee Peck joins us now with more on this story. And Lee, investigators say the suspect had no plans of giving up. Well, that's what they say, Shelby and Lenise. This started as a domestic violence call. A charged suspect, James Weeks, has faced before. Jail records showing he was arrested back in February of this year for domestic violence strangulation. Under the high lines at the end of Hunt Road in Robertsdale, signs of the four day standoff with Baldwin County Sheriff's deputies and Robertsdale police still remain. Deputies called to assist Robertsdale PD after 30 year old James Weeks allegedly armed and holding his two children hostage inside. That was on Monday. It would take three days of back and forth negotiations before Weeks would let the children free. But Weeks was not ready to surrender, according to investigators refusing to come out of the house, prolonging this days long standoff, leaving them with only one option to gas him out. Tear gas used in an attempt to force him out, only forcing Weeks into the attic. You can see where this is going. More gas deployed, Weeks eventually partially falling through the ceiling, giving SWAT team members the opportunity to not only take him into custody, but place him under arrest. It took a while to get there, but Weeks booked into the Baldwin County Jail this morning around 1.30. The children, both unharmed, now safe in the custody of DHR. And tonight, Weeks remains in the Baldwin County Jail facing several charges, including resisting arrest, domestic violence second, and possession of a controlled substance. Live in studio, Lee Peck, Fox 10 News.